So here is my K-Horn collection. I have a two-piece 1L, a one-piece 1L, a number one, a number two, and a very, very special, very unique number three bell. Now, probably one of the first things you'll notice is that I have um, machine screws threaded in from the back of the bell, and I have uh, nuts uh, holding on the back cap rather than just the usual bolts. Now, the reason for that is that I will be frequently removing the back cap. Now, why am I frequently removing the back cap? Well, this is no ordinary number three bell. This is actually a variable pitch number three bell. And let me show you what I mean by that. Take the back cap off. Take one of the diaphragms off. The other diaphragm and cushion ring stayed in the back cap there. All right, so here's the inside of the number three. Now, you'll notice it's been machined down quite a bit. Now, this is actually not a number three. This is a 3L. Um, rather than a number three plays an A sharp, and this one plays an A. However, you'll also notice that it has the three holes in it. Now, those three holes correspond to... Let me find them here three little socket screws. Now those three little screws are there to hold this into place. This is a removable shim that fits into the bell like so. Now with the shim installed it becomes a number three bell that plays an A sharp. With the shim removed it becomes a 3L that plays an A. And the idea here is that using the convertible number three bell and the other bells that I have, I can make four different K-series three chime horns. Now the first, the first combination that I'm going to show here is as I have that set up now with a two-piece 1L, a number one, and a 3L. And this is a, on a high manifold, a K3HLL and it actually is a three chime K that sounds just like a Leslie S3L. Now if I install the shim and swap out the the one L for a number two I get a K3H. And if I swap out the number three for a one piece one L I get a K3HL. So four different horns that I can make using this very special convertible number three bell.